The St. Lucia Tourism Authority, through its Caribbean brand and in partnership with the Guyana Tourism Authority, led a sales mission in Guyana from February 1st to the 6th in preparation for the introduction of new direct service between the two countries on British Airways beginning March 27th, 2023. The mission tapped into the vastly expanding Guyanese market to promote St. Lucia's tourism to attract more visitors. Led by Lorraine Charles and Jules, CEO of the St. Lucia Tourism Authority, the delegation included the marketing manager for the Caribbean region, events and sports, Christopher Gustav, and CEO and business development manager of the St. Lucia Hospitality and Tourism Association, Norani Aziz and Juliet Sutherland, respectively. St. Lucia's sales strategy included a lunch and learn session for 47 travel advisors, media engagements, and a business mixer with the Guyana Tourism Authority, CARICOM leaders, the Guyana Chamber of Commerce, and related partners on February 3rd. The recently concluded Guyana mission has been dubbed a success and it forms part of the St. Lucia Tourism Authority's strategy to increase visitor arrivals to the destination. And the St. Lucia Tourism Authority recognizes this as an opportune time for both St. Lucia and Guyana to capitalize on the service with British Airways that will be introduced come March 27th. And so this flight will come from London Gatwick via St. Lucia to the Chetty Jagan International Airport and from the Chetty Jagan International Airport to St. Lucia and then off to London. So this is an opportunity for us to collaborate and really form greater alliances in service in both St. Lucia and Guyana. St. Lucia has welcomed many Guyanese over the years and vice versa. So this is really an opportunity for us to integrate our cultures and really advance. The wider Guyanese population is now more informed about St. Lucia following the St. Lucia Showcase at Giffland Mall in Guyana on February 4th. The interactive showcase welcomed thousands of enthusiastic patrons who learned of St. Lucia's adventure, culinary and romance offerings, wellness options and much more. May 5th to the 4th, 2023, featuring artists that we all know and love and would love to experience being in the audience, uh, being fans of these artists too. Sting and Shaggy, I love these, I'm Shaggy. Uh, Reba, a whole lot of uh, uh, guests that we would have... Uh, uh, met before even here in Guyana, for example, Shansia, Kes the Band, Buju Pantan, uh, Bunji Garland, Fan Lions. Listen, a whole lot of artists will be there at the Jazz and Arts Festival May 5th to the 14th, 2023 in St. Lucia. So it is the place to be to experience amazing music, beautiful music, gyrating music as we experience the land of St. Lucia. Visitors were delighted to interact with and purchase on-the-spot packages with hotel partners, stolen time by rendezvous, body holiday, Bay Gardens Resorts and Harmony Marina Suites, and engage with knowledgeable Guyanese-based travel agents who joined the showcase. Of the thousands who visited the Caribbean St. Lucia Showcase, one lucky patron will walk away with an all-expense-paid five-night trip for two to the Bay Gardens Beach Resort. The draw is scheduled for February 10th, 2023 at 11 a.m. and the winner will be announced live on Caribbean St. Lucia's social media channels. The St. Lucia Tourism Authority aims to target the Guyanese diaspora, expanding expat population and the business community, for leisure and business travel through an integrated advertising campaign. The delegation is confident that the recently concluded mission will help to sensitize the Guyanese market further and increase the number of visitors from Guyana to St. Lucia, with British Airways serving as another option to the destination alongside Caribbean Airlines and Inter-Caribbean.